Government has made a commitment to beef up security at the seaports in Trinidad and Tobago. This is from National Security Minister Edmund Dillon following a national security meeting in Tobago on Tuesday. Minister Dillon said an interagency approach will be used in this regard. Patricia Nicholson was at the press, con the press briefing following the meeting and has the details. The Trinidad and the Tobago Police Service may be used to assist in the provision of security at the ports of Port of Spain and Scarborough as the Ministry of National Security moves to tighten security in these areas. Well, I don't want to go into details, of course, for obvious reasons, but I can tell you that it has a, a law enforcement input through the Trinidad and Tobago Police Service. All right, they have a, there's a maritime input through the Trinidad and Tobago Coast Guard, and of course the Port Authority themselves also involved in that. So we had Port Authority here represented also. So the discussion centered of an interagency approach to bring together security issues on the port. The minister responded to the long-standing plan to place scanners at the ports. Okay, that also came up with discussion with respect to the scanners, scanners at the port, both for passengers and for baggage. So we have noted the deficiency. I think there's one scanner, as I understand it today, and uh, uh, am, I, am I correct, Chief? There was from year one. There was one scanner. That's correct. Which, because as, as I said before, we had customs representative here today to give us an issue as to what are their deficiencies and so on. So that we have taken note of that, and we are looking at, in terms of looking at the whole security arrangement at the port, we're looking at not only scanners, both passengers and for baggage, but we're also looking at introducing um, through the Toronto Tobago Police Service a, a sort of a canine presence also. Securing all other areas of entry, specifically in Tobago, such as Charlottesville, was also taken into consideration. Minister Dillon said stricter measures would be implemented to secure these other ports of entry. Coast Guard and immigration officers, he said, were key in this aspect of the discussions. THA Chief Secretary Calvin Charles, though satisfied with the meeting on Tuesday, said national security meetings were held on numerous occasions in Tobago in the past, but implementation of plans had been a challenge. Everyone knows that there is an issue of implementation because a number of these issues are not new, but um, we are committed um, to change that dynamic. Um, and to move with greater speed to ensure the implementation of those things that we have agreed upon. Mr. Charles said he and Minister Dillon have committed to meeting more regularly to ensure initiatives outlined go according to plan. I'm Patricia Nicholson for C News.